Hey guys, welcome to another episode in the playthrough of Tomb Raider Remastered. Uh, first game, last level I think, the Great Pyramid. Uh, at the ending of the previous level, which ended um, right about there. Um, this level started uh, in this boss arena, let's call it like that. And we took out some weird, big, disfigured creature, not too hard. And um, yeah, we are now, this is really the start of that last level, the Great Pyramid. So here we go. We have to obtain, ah, we already have six pickups. There were quite some uh, Uzi clips lying around uh, in that boss arena. We have to get 31 pickups and three secret areas. So here we go. It would be so nice if the previous episode really took me hours of looking for a couple of uh, missed items. It was really, t um, yeah, almost trolling by the developers. There was, I initially ended the uh, episode with a two and uh, three items short, but I was aware that there was some kind of a glitch that you, one item you could not obtain. You can obtain it now. I think it was uh, fixed in a patch or maybe it was already possible uh, in the remastered version before the, the patch yesterday. Uh, but at least in the original game, you could not obtain one item which was placed outside the, the game um, uh, boundaries. Uh, but so I was missing two items approximately or that I really could pick up. Uh, and there was like this gate with two medipacks visible, like the gate was here and the medipacks were like, like one feet on the other side of the gate. And I spent hours, hours trying to open that gate only to find after really being 99.99999% yeah, sure it could not be opened because I literally tried everything you can humanly, uh, think of ah, there's actually uh, a way down but um, I read about in a forum post that those two medipacks were uh, are unobtainable they were just there to trigger some to lure you into pulling a lever that activated the trap so that was super annoying um, anywho we can get up there let's get up there only how do we get up there we need to there's no room to push this block, but we need to push this block and then we are high enough to jump on there. At least that is my plan. Ah, this is where we came from, right? So we need to go down below. <laughs> out here damn it's hard to make out uh, there's nothing really there right it does look like an edge over there as well ah, it looks like a it's a collapsible collapsible floor I do hope this level has less those flying monsters than the previous one. I found the enemies, the fighting, I don't really like it that much. It's too clumsy. I like the exploration better. And puzzling. Ah! 
I was not expecting there to be anything uh, here. Ah, this is the uh, crates that we saw at starts. And this is the collapsible floor. Find that a good moment to save. If I say so myself. Because this doesn't get anywhere, right? Just gets us to where we were. Yes. Slides down, two ways down. They end up same place. I doubt it. We have a lever over there. Let's first use this one. Push it further. And then Lara. We also, I don't think we can really pull it more than this. Alright, I have no idea what that did. Probably we need to push it forward, I think. Yes, then we can get to the lever. God damn it, Lara. <coughs> right, that should do it. Yes, we can still... Damn it, wrong button. Yeah, we can still move it in the right direction, but then the question is... How do we get back up to it? Ah, through the left side, I think. We cannot climb up now. Right, that will open that door over there, I'm sure. Quickly see if there's anything here. Nope. We move that crate to the left, so apparently there that opened up that corridor. This is uh, one of those sliding jumping sections. Is that a door? No, that's a bridge that we have to activate and then we can jump onto it. Pretty damn sure. 
All right, let's do this. Hope for, uh, it will probably be timed. I find that a little bit annoying, but it is what it is. One, two, almost went wrong. Ah, there's a door over there. For the rest, I don't see any hidden areas. All right, this looks to be like a running jump. Here we go. God damn it. Lara, what the hell are you doing? One. Two. Why are you pivot pivoting, Lara? God damn it. To, ah, I think I know what we need to do. God damn it. We need to jump to the other side. We need to do a diagonal. Like so. And then we go like... So, that almost went wrong. Then we go like... So, those sparks actually um, damage Lara, I think. And now we go like... Let's quickly watch the textures. How did they look in the original? Uh, again, very similar. Just better. It's so nicely done. Alright, can we walk this or is it yeah we can walk that. It's a dirt dirt path. <coughs> Nothing here, right? far as I see. Holy shit. <coughs> God damn it, Lara. Fuck me, I didn't save. Not that we are that far from where we need to be, but still from where we died. But Oh, fuck my life, fuck my life, fuck my life. That's the problem always. It's really not that hard, but it's just super easy to mess it up anyways. So we jump forward, we jump backward, and we do a side flip. Forward. Like so. Back flip didn't really work. But we had enough time. Nice. 
There are suspiciously few. Oh fuck! 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 I didn't say fuck me. <laughs> we have a saying in my native tongue: a donkey doesn't. Um, hit his head twice or something like that on the same stone apparently I do because that was really stupid alright here we go So we do forward, we do a backward, and we do a side. Holy shit, that was close. And I am going to, it's not really, sp oh shit, uh, spam saving, but safe's coming, however you call it. I don't want to have to do this too much anymore backflip doesn't really work that well oh fuck me this is what i mean good thing i saved you can why shouldn't wouldn't you be able to do a side flip there all right i will just run my way Like so, very good. No complicated. Backpedaling, just sprinting straight forward. And I almost would think there could be a secret area somewhere here, but apparently not. You cannot know that first time around. What the hell? Alright, so how does that work? What the hell can you do? Ah, that was indeed, I think, the collapsible floor that we saw. down below no that's not what I wanted to do there huh? I wanted to look around there really is nothing here I, I would have expected something to be here because this is a dead end for the rest right We're looking for a lever because on the other side there was that bridge in that lava room. At least it looked like a bridge. Oh wait! It's hard to make out. Is that a floor or? Yeah, I think. Maybe something there. Or not. No, I don't think there is. What is the purpose of this floor? Of this collapsible, collapsible floor?
nothing, right? And the developers, they're so good at just putting you on the wrong path. What the hell does this do? Shouldn't I have pulled a lever by now? I cannot make this full, I'm pretty damn sure. I think this is just a trap. But the problem is, I also don't really see any other way. Or was there something here? No. Some of these textures, they look a little bit like out of place like darker than the rest so maybe like a door or something but yeah i'm not going to try and interact with each and every wall panel so normally when you have to put in a lot of effort to get to a place it's a way to proceed, right? Holy shit, I'm stuck at the start of the level. We have a bridge over there, I see it now clearly. There is an also a bridge half at the back wall. I see a tiny bit of a bridge half. There was also one on the other side. So those two will swing up and connect to each other to form one bridge. But we are looking for a lever or something to activate it. And there really appears to be only one way. I mean, why would they add this whole area if it just leads to nowhere? Putting on the classical graphics, maybe I can identify a lever easier, but I doubt it. here and damn it holy hell <laughs> wow these textures down below they I almost thought like hey the modern graphics are uh, active again but looks actually pretty good for 25 year old graphics um, yeah, I have no clue what to do. All right, now we're back down. But that didn't do anything because we were already here, right? I know, this is a new area. Now we're back at the uh, previous level. It's pretty funny. Oh. Also back at... Annoying enemies. Let's first take out the enemy, or at least... <sighs> I thought I heard one. 
because I don't only want to get all the items. It would also be nice to get all the kills. Yeah. I hear an enemy, but... I don't see it. Whatever, let's shoot it. jump because it's super I wonder whether it's even possible to jump alright this is very tricky in time Fuck me.
this really didn't do anything. How to open up this freaking bridge? I'm really quite confident. All right, 560, I need to remember. I will write it down. Um, that if we now go back to that thing that we shot, that artifact, and continue our way the other direction, there's a good chance that I'm just overlooking something here. And that we then just go in the total, that we never end up here anymore. And then I, after I finish the level, I have to backtrack all the way here, check out how to get, I think that's a secret area over there. because there's not that much to do here actually it does feel uh, appropriately uh, climactic with this whole Pyramids collapsing. Maybe there's a lever down below. I doubt it. You never know.
Nothing here, right? I don't see anything. Continue. Um, yeah, I can basically just as well load a previous save. When we were already here. Damn it, Lara. And here we go. I think bum burst again. Fuck me, I should have saved. Oh, fuck me, fuck me, fuck me, man. How hard is it? It's not hard. fighting mechanic it's so clumsy it's so annoying 
really is not that hard. It's just there's only one thing that it is. That is annoying. bum rush by them at least the one over there only triggers once you are way too close and then he just jumps there he is We are now going in a totally different direction. Although there is a way back here. All right, that's good. That maybe leads to that bridge. I don't know, but I must not forget about that bridge. Pretty certain that could be a uh, secret area. Ah, no, that is the path that I just saw that is probably the main path to take because this is all a dead end although now there is also a way to walk down below but yeah does it do anything yes there is a way down there that may be the main path. I don't know what the main path is. Probably that one. Uh, nothing here. Alright, I'm first going to check out the one over there. We have two roads. Over here and then one. Going down. Fuck me, this one also doesn't do anything. Yeah, and then I really need to figure out that bridge first before going further. Because we will not be, if we are now going all the way down in this pyramid, which is a long way down, there uh, we, we will not be getting back to where we came from, I am almost certain. So that bridge is something that I. should activate in that area really feels like old school gaming by the way those side scrolling prince of persia games right this is a very i would say tricky job to make that one even possible and I fuck me fuck me man didn't load holy shit again super messy Oh my fucking 
often I want to turn her around her axis and she does a side jump. Uh, a back jump. Ah, there we go. It's actually much easier than I expected. Alright, that's really hard to avoid. I'm not even gonna bother to be honest, sorry. I don't even think if it's possible to avoid. Because this shimmying. Oh, fuck my life. And again, I didn't save. Fuck. My fucking life. Such an idiot. So messy. I think there's a way to... No, there's no way to get through here. I would say, it. I, I, th maybe there is. I don't know how, those, how other people do the no damage runs. Oh, oh, fuck me, man. Fuck me. Exactly. The same death, I just... It's so annoying. You know what's coming up and I just totally forget. There must be a way to get through here unharmed. Maybe disable... These fucking arrows, but... Honestly... I don't think we ever disabled Maybe if you shimmy at just the right moment you can get the timing right Otherwise I don't think that we ever were able to disable darts to get back to
where we were with that bridge, so... I can go ahead further in the game, but that means I will have to do it afterwards all again. If I need to reload this in anyways to get the, uh, the secret area here. Yeah, you tell me. like a pressure plate or like every panel looks the same is a pressure plate we just have to you just cannot see it you just have to test it out but then we have to randomly move the crate and then each time see if the bridge opened up which also really it's also far-fetched but at one point in this game, you're really starting to grasp at no fucking Lara. You you grasp at straws. No way. Now she cannot get out anymore. Fuck me, man. So she can climb up, but she cannot get off anymore because there's not enough room with the inclining uh, roof or the uh, ceiling.
because it's too, it's more than three squares, which is like the running jump distance. trying to activate that bridge maybe it is further ahead in in the game i can hardly imagine it and it would also be too bizarre if you're like you have to go down like several floors and then literally like a mile away and then there would be something that activates that random bridge and then you have to backtrack all the way there that doesn't make sense but i'm not sure it's not the case so maybe I'm now wasting time looking for a solution here while the solution is just continuing the game and then you'll find it yourself. sound was pretty impressive at first, but it's now getting quite annoying, all the hectic sounds. So the other collapsible floor, I thought it was this one, but that, that's why I found it a bit weird. Um, Alright, so this is just unobtainable. Uh, yeah, we cannot get there anymore. Down here. 
here and see what's behind this box. Maybe we already did that. Let's check it out if I have a safe. Alright, this is before the whole everything went haywire. to be even earlier. Here we go, all the way it starts. At least it's much more quiet. That's pretty nice. Yeah, I think I have I'm not sure whether I have a plan, but I think I do. Yes, like so. We don't want to move it to this square because then we cannot move it back anymore. But what we can do now is pull this one out and then circle around to see what's behind it. Alright, please be a lever. Fuck me, nothing. particular four tiles that look like a pressure plate. So, yeah. Again, I'm th they're trolling me so hard, these developers. I'm just totally stuck at the start of the level. How stupid is that? Try and see if once we are in 
in the tunnel We have to make our way ourselves over there. But then see if that, that specific rock wall over there can be pushed. I doubt it because there's only room for one uh, grid. Again, that's what this game makes you do. You're just clasping at straws. Clasping or grasping, whatever the saying is. No, oh, fuck me, man. Fuck me, fuck me, fuck me, fuck me so fucking hard. Fuck me so fucking hard. It takes so much time. And it really... It really is like... Oh, probably there is something super obscure. By the way, let's first check out Stella. Sometimes it says in the description of the Stella forums whether an achievement or a pickup or collectible is bugged. It could very well be bugged. What the hell is this? Fuck me, man. All right, see you later. Account policy update. Um, we do. Stella Tomb uh, TR Pyramid Right, kill six, item thirty one, secrets three with a note. Even if you find it and pick up the items, the third secret in this level may not register in some versions of the game. This is a bug. Kill the big beastie, find Natla, who has apparently survived, and bump her off as well, then get out of town. Passageway with movable blocks. Alright, I read it, so, no, I didn't read it fully, um, but there is, it's not glitched, but I think, no, yeah, I don't feel it, uh, read it at all, but the solution is somewhere here. It said something like, Lara stopped her toe or something. Alright, so I actually have no clue what the solution is, but I do know it's somewhere here and it is not glitched. So yeah, is that cheating? I don't know.
So yeah, it's so obscure. Apparently, I did this diagonal jump. Apparently, you have, you need to. Um, be on that sliding uh, part all right at least that didn't take like hours longer and yeah was it a cheat yeah semi i don't feel totally fine with it but yeah it is what it is At least I know, I, I really only wanted to look like, okay, where do I not need to look, so to say. Because sometimes you really don't know in this game. did a direction so then it if you do first a direction and then jump you need to have like uh, one or two steps before she actually jumps because then it will be a, uh, considered a running jump but if you fucking press jump first you should do a standing jump it's so fucking annoying fuck this game man. fuck this game sometimes i really had it so hard That took a really long time because, yeah, again, the solution is totally obscure. That there is no visible, vi uh, visual cue that says, like, yeah, you have to go to one of those ramps, and that will um, 
Activate the drawbridge. frustration uh, for me to be honest I don't know suddenly it hit me that uh, yeah I was actually becoming a little bit frustrated so I will take a little break maybe I will do uh, a bit more progress later tonight it's not uh, 10 o'clock yet uh, that's normally when I really need to eat and head to bed uh, but probably it will be tomorrow after work guys hope you enjoyed hope to see you there and for the meantime don't forget to always do keep on gaming later by the way sorry for my cussing and cursing for my frustration see you later